I'm sorry, I need to fucking, I'm so goddamn thirsty. What a gal. What's going on everybody? It is Redgrave here and we are back with more Bayonetta 3 going through chapter one, finally. I have a lot more time to actually go through this now. So I'm hoping that for this current episode, we'll be able to go through two missions worth, uh, two to three anyways, and then sort of go from there. So instead of doing the super long uploads like I normally have, we'll just, split them up a little bit more so that they're just a little bit smaller. That's sort of what my thinking is. By the time I get to the VODs, I might change that, but uh, we'll see how it goes. But I was really enjoying the intro, and um, I'm really excited to play more, so let's let's get to it. Oh, she gets, she gets bigger, too. I just realized. When she turns into Madama Butterfly. Bum, 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 bum. Yo, Gates of Hell looks mad different. And the music is slightly di different too. Why not split each mission, each video in one mission each? Cause I think that would just bloat the uploads a little bit. Um, I think like, one or two missions sort of like you know that 45 minute range i think that's like 45 minutes to an hour might do it or even like an hour and a half just so they're not like giant three hour uploads you know i wish starbucks would look like this Oh my god, Enzo's in the game and not just in the intro. But I knocked some sense into him. After all. So what's different in this one in terms of button mappings? Have they have they finally gave players the option to remap? I mean the other game had options to remap, but they didn't they don't have like full customizable controls in this though. They just have different types. You mean those weren't your playmates? Not my type. Are you having funsies? With the one mission that I played, I was having a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun to where I was like, do I really want to be playing Resident Evil on Sunday? I did, to be fair, but, you know, I've been wanting to play this. There she is, there's Viola. How about you tell us who you are first, Miss... And reaping! Viola. Oh, it's Viola, not Viola. Viola! Bayonetta, I'm... Uh, never mind. Look, we don't have time. If we don't stop them, this world is history. And reality as we know it gets wiped out for good! My god, she's so emotional. And so you just led them right to us. <laughs> she just booped her with the lollipop. No! What an asshole. <laughs> locusts spreading through the multiverse. I didn't try the mercenaries mode, not yet. Just trust me, damn it. We've got to hurry. Bayonetta. John, you both. I always have R1 as lock on, so it hasn't been that big of an issue for me. taught you that bit of magic imagine if she didn't have witch time well, didn't have witch time gone. john just Before shoots the main character and dies bad which is only exactly aphrodite exactly also welcome in everybody who's just but joining in now. hope you're all having a good tuesday so far and everything else V the voice actress for Viola actually did uh, a charity stream for Bayonetta 3, dresses Viola and dresses Bayonetta. I would check it out if you guys haven't already. I also haven't checked it out, but that's because I haven't played Bayonetta 3 yet. So once I do that, I will check it out. Just finished the game last night? Hell yeah. 
then this ain't just a human problem. Yeah, I like how Rodan isn't in a coat anymore. He just has like a form-fitting shirt that just makes him look so nice. made up of countless universes, all stacked up together. That's the multiverse. Also finished the game a few hours ago. Damn, I gotta catch up. One by one. No, wiping out doesn't quite explain it. They're breaking the multiverse down. Trying to fuse it. Together. Yeah, it was only a matter of time that before they went into the multiverse of madness. I mean, they've been doing time travel since the first game. Beef through a grinder to make a big old juicy burger. Woo! That's not a burger, that's a drink. They'll get their hands on enough time to wipe out the whole trinity in a snap. Oh, look, another dead weight. <laughs> Thank you, Professor. And time for the Bayonetta verse. Yeah, I'm waiting for Dante to show up. I'm waiting for a male Bayonetta with white hair and a red coat who happens to say Yippee, Yahoo, and Jackpot, and Pizza. To do? That's what I'm expecting right. by the end of this. There are two things we have to do. <clears throat> I want you to find a scientist named Sigurd. He's somewhere in this Excuse world, me. and he can help us. And Bayonetta, I want you to come with me to help find more of these. Nuts. This is a chaos gear, the key to beating Singularity. Also, I'm going to assume there's a giant cat. Dr. Sigurd. Why is there a giant cat? We can kiss this world goodbye. Is that Enzo in a giant cat suit? What? <laughs> was that was that giant cat there the entire time? Also, that's cool. She had the um She had the the pieces that you she had the cards from Loki, but then also the figure from the first game. That's cool. Yo, bacon was good. So anyway, Viola. You gonna introduce me to this thing or what? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the giant cat is just there. Cheshire cat. So dramatic. And she's like, oh, this is my little kitty cat. Okay. His <laughs> name is Singularity. He unraveled the secret of the multiverse before anyone else. Just a cat. Declaring his own world the Alphaverse, he began destroying the other layers of the multiverse one by one. There's only one. I love it already. Take the fight to him in the Alphaverse. That three's background, life's the details from seven years ago, they did the it massively upgraded it. Yeah, I'm wondering what that's about in terms of the, uh, <clears throat> maybe the budget or, um, maybe they wanted to actually go for, like, the full realized cutscenes instead of the still frames. The secluded island of Thule. Are you sure your fantasy island is real? <clears throat> Goddamn cat! <laughs> the path will open. Did you get any special costumes for the edition you got? Nah. I got a Bayonetta 1 and Bayonetta 2 switch case that had nothing in it. And an art book that I can't look at. Bayonetta 3! Wanna know the name? Bayonetta 3. The threequel. Hmm. Someone seems very interested in our arrival. Is it him? Let's land fast. It's not safe. Yes, my T-posing Cheshire cat. 
It's Luca. What's that? It was Luca, you dingus. Oh, never mind. I guess it wasn't Luca. Phew. So is Cheshire gonna be uh, Viola summon? Oh. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Viola's gonna be here to help me. Got the witch time. Bye bye. So great. Oh, that's kind of weird. You can only get the save data if you have, uh, you can only get the guns if you have save data from Bayo 1 and 2 on your Switch. That is kind of whack. Now, where are my guns? Oh, this is so weird. It's weird not having Panther within, you know? Also, Viola just following me. Now, what are you? Oh, that's just currency, okay. Also, did the grass just load in this? I think it did. Old guns can't use the new mechanics in this? Oh, that's whack. I can't do my super special dance a jigger Kage no Jutsu. Yeah. Pretty sure those are other worlds in the multiverse. I bet the people who built this place used to watch over different worlds the same way. <laughs> Press left to receive guidance for your next destination. Oh, thank Christ they have that. <laughs> Block off. It's kind of a given that, like, we would get the weapons from 1 and 2. Um, but as far as, like, any other, like, gameplay or story spoilers, let's definitely keep that to a minimum. There we go. It's kind of weird how similar yet different this is. Okay, so we're supposed to go over there. Oh, is that a secret mission? Okay. Yeah, it is a secret mission. Dude, I know I said this in the, the first part, but this is giving me major No More Heroes 3 vibes. All right, bite and toss them. Uh, okay. Bite and toss him. Oh, 
Oh, shit. Nom, 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 nom. Nom, noms. This is so strange. All right, so real quick. You feel the burn, don't you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, so hold this and scroll. What is this? Dodge plus... Also, is it just me or was that a huge frame drop right there? Alright, so I need to go where again? I think it's up here, right? Yeah. I think there's just a lot about this that's really trippy. I'm starting to like it here. The red dries in the transition, <laughs> Jesus. So, so that just recharges everything. Cool. First three, bet. Wait, what? <laughs> nom noms. Nom nom nom. It doesn't show you the bottom. Oh, that's weird. I didn't even notice that. Fly like a butterfly. Like the butterfly you were always meant to be, Bayonetta. Info. Summon barriers. Infernal demons can't be summoned in spaces that are too cramped or narrow. Oh, okay. That's fine. It's not like that's gonna be an integral part of this gameplay, right? <laughs> right? Just needs the right touch. Any true Umbra witch knows that. This trip has been full of surprises, hasn't it? Is this a multiverse portal generator? Bayonetta, wait, it might Every be time I see multiverse, I just think multiverses now. I hate it. Let me just pick up all of these, thank you. Too late for regrets now, I'm afraid. Bayonetta! Separate vacations for now, then. Good luck. You must have been dying. Yeah, exactly. Yo, same, actually. Summon slots. You can equip up to three infernal demons and slots and switch between them instantly in battle. So I can press which one. If you switch while summoning, the new one will appear in the same place. Okay. So, I have Gamora, and I have Madama Butterfly. What else do I have? Color my world. Wait. Okay, never mind. Items? Yep, I have the Witch Recipe tab again. So, what can I make this time? Oh, I can make the bell again. That's cool. I'm going to have to use that a lot for, for grinding purposes. Characters, item catalog.
There we go. Do it. I like that. That's cool. Can you step on me though? Only if you ask nicely, Bacon. I, I wonder if getting the... Oh, oh, okay, hold on. I wonder if getting, like, Love is Blue would, uh, give me my, uh, my Panther back. My Panther Within back. But yeah, no, these environments are huge. Flockle! All right, no secret missions back over here. Cool. Oh. Okay. No, not the forced walking segment. How dare you, Platinum? When will we learn? Oh, no, I'm not ready yet! Didn't your mother ever teach you some manners, you freaking gabagoose? Bye bye. Oh wait, what? No, that was bullshit. I got, I got hit. I got hit off screen. That wasn't fair. We will be changing to another track. If you are standing, please hold on to a hand strap or a rail. Roar! Oh, I remember this! This is in Metal Gear Rising! Kinda, sorta. Use tackle! Oh, nope, that didn't work. Rawr, I'm a dinosaur. Gamora used tackle. It was very effective. Oh my god, this is so weird. Rawr! Jesus Christ, man, what? What is going on right now? Oh my god! 
I'm literally surfing on boats. <laughs> oh my god, what? Rolling around at the speed of sound. Oh shit. Elephant dinosaur thing, you son of a bitch! Greedy little thing. Perhaps it's time for a crash diet. Bayonetta, your elephant literally died. Why are you not sad? Giants leave behind cloud like mist in their wake that breaks down whatever it touches, even Bayonetta. Oh shit, so I should not touch that. Thank you. I blame you! Oh no, Gamora's fine, never mind. Gamora's okay. I feel like there's something over here that Platinum wants me to do. I was wrong for once, what? This is usually where like a secret mission would be, or at least like something, but no, there was nothing there. Whack. Whack, whack I tell you. Yo, look at these average looking shoulders. Look at them, they're like, oh, we're gonna kill this thing with bullets, and Bayonetta comes in and she's like, you don't have these bullets, though. There is something there? What the fuck? What was it? Because I just totally missed it. A cat? Oh, is it the cat reference? That's funny. <laughs> If I cut in, wouldn't want to step on anyone's toes. Yeah, this was from the first gameplay trailer, wasn't it? Don't worry, I know this song by heart. It's a number in Tears of Blood. Oh, okay, I'll go back for it at some point then. Lock off! Oh, shit. Nom noms! Jesus Christ, man. What are you doing? Oh! Nom noms!
Nom noms. Oh, I just straight up missed. Hey, hey, yo, hey, we don't attack off screen. You might be from another reality, but that should be common courtesy. go back for that umbran tears of blood oh i missed an encounter hello there you are hey 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 yo hey yo get back here no get get back here you little rascal what the what Stupid cat. Get back here! What? Bro, what? <laughs> what? How am I supposed to catch this thing? Get back here, you little asshole. Oh, come on, it's right there. It's right there. Right, I'm going to cut it off. Wow, clearly cutting it off didn't do anything. Hit the thing on top, knock it down. Are you being dead ass right now? Like, is that what I'm supposed to do? What thing? What, this thing? And the little gap area? What the fuck? You just need to catch it. I really can't tell if you guys are fucking with me or not. I feel like it's getting fat. You know what? Fuck this. <laughs> yeah, I ain't fucking doing that. I ain't fucking doing that. No thanks. There was a ladder that I knocked down and it climbed up. Yeah, you're right, there isn't a button prompt. Yeah, it's like all the stuff that we have to do in Bayonetta isn't that, isn't that difficult, but... Platforming and chasing cats. That'll do... I swear to... Alright, what do we gotta do here? Blow kisses to them. Okay. Wait, what the? Did I... Did I do it? I did. There we go. Yeah, that's a long-ass wind-up.
You feel the burn, don't you? Oh, okay. Never mind, I guess. I low-key want to chase that cat again because it's going to bug the shit out of me. But at the same time... It's about time I got moving. Come on! If, whatever. Whatever. You can preload it as enemies are loading in. Ah, oh, okay. Ooh, can I actually go? See, th this was the mistake of them doing this because now I just want to explore everything. Oh, you jerk. Ow. Oh my god, he tried to attack me from off-screen again! What? Oh my god. Tears now unlock alternate chapters if you collect all three. Interesting. Yeah, take that, you mannequin. It's a frog! Having an outdoor recital? What the so, the frog just walks up to me, and it's like, Hey, do you want to be my friend, Bayonetta? Here's the Umbran tier for this level. Whereas the cat's like, Nah, fuck you, Bayonetta. You gotta fucking earn it. My lord. Accurate to the species. That don't mean I like it, Cosmic. Also, what's up, Cosmic? How you doing? Did you, uh, did you finish Bayonetta 3, by the way? I remember you tweeted about, like, not running it? Or maybe, like, just playing it casually? But I can't remember if you said that you beat it. Finished it? Nice. I think the main thing that I'm glad about is that hard mode is actually hard. I, I, it feels more challenging than Bayo 2 for sure. Must be off your game. Never been more on. Well, all right. But I will say, like I said before, I really do like the fact that there aren't any like still Things frames anymore. Going on. It's Hell, just, they're just all full cutscenes. But chaotic economics has its own unique jobs. And you'd like me to help you diversify. <laughs> I can't tell so if she's just tucking her braids like underneath her armpits or if it's just clipping through.
Ah, I gotta love the classics. Why is he dressed like Freddy Krueger? It is Halloween after all. Welcome to if Bayonetta 2 is a Christmas game, this is absolutely a Halloween game. You can expect a fair rate for these now, too. Of course, I'll gladly accept any halos you bring in. <laughs> it's November now already? Mighty yeah, true. Special for you. But the game came out on the 28th, which makes it a Halloween game. All right, so sleeping dog statue. Use with Super Mario Three, Super Mario Three accessories. Gaze of despair enrages enemies even without taunting them. Increases magic power recovery speed after full completion. Uh, prevents infernal demons from being enraged by enemy attacks. Performs combos and defensive actions automatically. Wait, what? Simply by pressing when used at standard or higher, battle results are. Oh, so that's just easy automatic. That was in the last game, too. Um. Let me. Actually, let me see what else there is. I will take one of those. I will take... Wait. There's not a... There isn't a way to buy uh, health and... Uh, what is it? Health and uh, magic upgrades. I'll take a red hotshot, though. Oh, wait, what? I didn't mean to buy two. And then I'll get the other one later. Almost forgot to give you this. There's no limit now? Oh, okay. Well, goddamn! Is that a Gamora Gatling gun? Holy shit! <laughs> Okay. Change weapons and accessories on the equipment tab. A giant club containing an anti-material rifle. Oh! That's sick. I'm using that immediately. Um, wait a minute. I just realized something. Never mind. There is a way to switch weapons. Ignore me. Um, give me the gun. Wait a minute. Is... Are there not arm and leg sets anymore? It's just weapon and weapon? Because that's weird. That's very weird. That is very, very, very strange. I don't know how I feel about that. In a minute, I'm doing stuff. Now you get new finishers per weapon and new demon forms. One. Two, three. That is pretty cool, actually. Ah, oh, that is cool. That is pretty cool, actually. All right, defeat all the enemies. Yo, bet I missed this. Let's fucking do this! Yo, can you? Oh. 
Oh, whoops, hold up. Oh, hello! Two. One, two, three, four. Oh my god, I just, I was just about to get sniped. There we go. Also, did it lock me into a certain set, or did I do that on accident? Thanks, John. Come on. Oh, I still missed one. Ah, so it did lock me in. Interesting. Also, it's kind of weird that I have to hold the button now instead. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Townsville. I'm coming. I was told... Are you... Are you down here? Hello? Ah, okay. Oh, wait, there's something over there. I see it. I'll take this, thank you. It's really weird not having a left trigger for a uh, for weapon switch. Oh, there's a tear over there. I'm, I'm gonna get it. 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 You son of a gun. Are we really doing this? Huh? Are we really gonna do this? <sighs> Alright, let's try that again. Entry here, it seems. Oh wait, I got it actually. Let me just uh Ah oh, you fucking No <laughs> Is he gonna go? Come on! No! <laughs> this is whack. No! Shit! Fuck! Damn it! No! No! God damn! Oh, whatever. Let's try this again. Oh my god. They go on a predictable pattern at least.
Oh my god, I keep missing it. Yeah, I feel like I just keep missing it. The crows and cats will be easier with the skills you unlock later. Alright, you know what? Well, in that case, I'm just gonna not bother. Stun with Infernal Demons. Stun enemies with Infernal Demons or break their armor for torture attack chances. Alright, well... There we go. Oh, no mashing, all right. There we go. You don't have to press Y to collect them unless you were accidentally pressing Y. Uh, no, I was pressing Y because I thought that the prompt would come up to press Y. That's why, that's why I was like shooting instead because that, that was why, yeah. But if I don't need to do that and I just need to catch them, then I think it'll be a little bit more convenient. Um, but for, like, the cat especially, like, even then, I, there was no way I was going to be able to catch up to it. Ooh, there's a thing up here. I'm going to take this. Thank you. Okay. I remember that. I just have to run into them. Oh, my God. No, I just wanted the fucking weapon switch. This is so weird. I want to... Why the... Platinum, I swear to God, dude. Oh, you... <laughs> you know what I love? I love... I love how they took the modern game design of giving us a photo mode, right? Look at this, look at this detailed photo mode that they give us here, right? So they take that, but they don't give us customizable controls. They don't give me the ability to have my weapon swap on, on L2. What? <laughs> Ah! Unlocking Umbra and Power. On the skills tab of the subscreen, you can increase maximum vitality and magic and unlock special skills. All right, increase by using Witch Hearts and your maximum magic by using Moon Pearls. You can get special items as you traverse across areas. Um, learning skills, orbs earned from battle are used to unlock skills. Each skill requires a set amount of orbs to unlock. Earn orbs by doing things like performing big combos and breaking enemy armor with infernal demon attacks. So it's not just about the money money anymore. It's about this. Okay. Okay. You have to up your HP manually now, which is nice because you can just not make your HP part bigger if you don't want to. Makes sense. Hannes! Oh no, we got the Beyblade of the game. Be 
much for your techniques why don't i try a more attentive approach hmm, okay ow ow ah oh, listen here you little shit Christ. Oh, I didn't even think that something hit me. That should kill it. the skill tree thing again why yes I do have witch time thank you um so this is just for Bayonetta herself so cut oh god wow all right um nectar seeker madama butterfly okay a blink charge So I have this unlocked already. Oh, I can disable the ability too, that's cool. Um, Rising Barrel, kind of interesting, I don't have that unlocked already. Um, full Moon Shots. <laughs> Bullet Climax. Um, oh, that's the one that I'm seeing in the trailers all the time, this one. And it costs, yeah, these all cost money. So let me get this. Uh, rising Barrel. Uh, yeah, let me just get the launchers, because why wouldn't I get the launchers, right? Um, yeah. So, Madama Butterfly, and then we have these, so... Dragon Buster! That's cool. And then for these, obviously gotta get that within. Yeah, this is cool. And guess what? I am nearly dead. Um, I really don't want to use a health item, though. This has been a long mission, too. Yeah, I kind of figured that the red ones would be for the, the demon slaves. I like the demon slave stuff, but I feel like I'm just like, gotta get bats with him, gotta get the launchers. You know, the basics. The things that have been in the game since day one. It's like, uh, it's like when DMC still forces you to buy uh, enemy step, you know? 
Are you enjoying the visuals and music so far? I think, like, it's very, like, shiny looking. Like, you know, like, it's, there's a lot of, like, particles and stuff that make it very shiny. I think the music is fantastic. Um, it just has, like, a... It has, like, a different style than the other ones. Like, this definitely gives me a more, like, No More Heroes vibe, you know? Better open up the HQ in my line of business. Times like this turn cash flow into a flood. Press... Oh, that's just entering the gates of hell. Uh, in addition to choosing your next location, you can also press to bring up a train and change options. Uh, in gallery, you can view stuff. Bayonetta... Phenomena found a signature handgun. Scarborough Fair has been added to the shop. Love is Blue has been added to the shop. Yo, let me go to the shop real fast so I can get that stuff. Might have something special for you. Uh, where would it be? Ooh! Okay, now I can buy stuff. Now I can buy it. Scarborough Fair and Love is Blue. I want to, I want to, but I know I shouldn't. I want to, but I know it is within my best interest not to. Okay, are you able to withstand the use of bullet arts? There are no second fiddle to Scarborough Fair in terms of power. Oh, I forgot to get that, that accessory. Oh, and I can save my current progress. That's cool. I mean, like, I, yeah, how dickish of it, how dickish of it would be for me to be like, you know what? Like, nah, these new weapons ain't doing it for me. I'm just gonna go back to Bayo 2. I'm gonna play this game like it's Bayo 2. John. 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 Oh, never mind. The still frames are back. Yo, it's Phantom. Hello, Phantom. Yeah, so we are really going into multiverse territory. <clears throat> Who's that? <laughs> oh my god, already? What a disappointing catch. No, that's not its name. Its name is Phantom Bayonetta. I'm wearing this shirt for a reason. What a disappointing catch. <laughs> I understand this reference. I understand this reference. Jackpot, am I right? What? Is, is there not going to be a boss fight? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, what the hell, man? I wanted to fight the spider and claim him as my own. That's so sad! I 
I was I was ready. I could I could hear what's the song? Fucking Red Hot something. I could hear it, bro. Red hot juice. Slow them down. Block off. I guess the unofficial time that goes DMC one then the Bayo City. Yeah, absolutely. I was so ready. Yo, Quanta Fox. Hey, I'm so glad I finished the game. That way I can watch it, enjoy the game. Hell yeah! I'm glad that you enjoyed the game and thank you for tuning in. When they use the bubble, gotta break it using the demons. I was kind of wondering what that was about. Kind of makes sense. Cause that's not the first time I've seen that, but I'm sure I'll find out all those other gameplay things as I uh, as I go through. Oh no, it's all good. It's all good. I'm trying to keep it as like. Ignorant as possible, but obviously I know that people are excited to like share all of their knowledge that they've learned so far I'm like literally just getting started like I um I obviously had uh the prologue experience on uh on Friday, but I haven't I literally haven't looked at anything else Oh shit Oh, you missed me! Oh, I totally missed that, didn't I? One, two... Madama Butterfly! Oh, hey, yo, hey, wait! Your... Turn! Ow. Oh, and that broke armor too, I think. Oh, I was gonna go in for the torture attack, but it didn't work. I, I didn't get there in time. I'm not gonna lie, I think I like this track a lot more than the Bayo 1 and 2 combat track. Phew. You're very good at hacking and slashing. It's fun to watch. I appreciate that. Um, for those of you that actually don't know my prior experience, I'm mainly like a DMC. Well, obviously, like, I have it in the title, but I'm mainly like a Devil May Cry hack and slash kind of person. Um, started playing Bayonetta um, <clears throat> back in September, and I always knew I was going to play Bayonetta at some point. Um, I just wasn't sure when, but coincidentally, you know, when Bayo 3 is here, it was the perfect time to get into it. Moonlight Serenade. Yeah, I really love that theme. I think it's probably my favorite out of all the themes so far. I wouldn't know since I never played. Yeah, it's a parody of, well, it's a parody of, De of, uh, of Phantom, yeah. It's like, yeah, it's kind of like the same creature, yeah. That That's the reference, is that it's, uh, it's Phantom. Yeah, I'm sure there's some, like, 
like canon reason for it or something like that, but yeah, that's the main thing. So I see that there's a wall crawl prompt. I can take the heat, but that's a bit much. So I'm sure that I can climb on walls. So let me see if I can. Uh... Oh my god! <laughs> that's cool. <sighs> No, she didn't say the quote from Dante, um, that Dante said. It wasn't the same quote, but, like, the, this motion where, she, like, she knocked on him, that was it. You can warp around that for the challenge, yeah. So let me... Can I... I'm assuming I can just go through here, right? No? It's about time I got um... Okay, so I, I know that there's something I gotta do with Phantom. Can I, like, step on top of him or something? Oh. I tried to get Madama Butterfly to put out the fire. She punished me for that. That's hilarious. Do it. Ah, okay. I see. Was not expecting to have to do that. Torture attack. There we go. One, two, three, four. I love how I missed every shot. Wow, Bayonetta, your aim in this game is absolute garbage. Just like mine in Resident Evil. She actually got mad and hit you. I'm gonna have to go back and try to see if I can pull off something like that, because that's, that's really funny. Let me grab this. Actually, wait a minute. I'm supposed to, uh... I have a secret mission I gotta do. Hold on a minute. Was it... Yeah, there it is. What if evil and Resident Evil get to victim? <laughs> Wouldn't that solve the whole series? You're, ac you're actually right. You're out of line, Necro, but you're right. Okay, limited time, which time damage only, and no torture attacks. Bet. Just give me like two seconds to uh, to look at all this stuff. Use orbs to unlock new skills. I will. Oh, never mind. I guess I won't. Um. Nah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna buy these. Actually, that's that's actually what I'm gonna do. Bullet climax. What is this? Oh, never mind. Uh, heel slide. Obviously need that. All oh, right, I was saving up for that. Whoopsie Daisy. It's only wish time. All right. Come on, take your best shot, fools. Oh, shit. Right. Come on.
Oh, shit. Come on. Two, three, four. Yeah, which time lasts quite a while, doesn't it? Wait, what the fuck? completely forgot about uh, enraged enemies giving you half witch time. Okay, so maybe... Alright, let's try this. I feel like, um... I didn't really get as much uh, witch time by using the, um... The, what is it? Um... The, uh, the summons. Madama Butterfly, what are you even- oh, that's where you're hitting. Oh my god, come on. Come on. Two, three, four. Oh! Right, no torture attacks. Alright, come on. Come on, fucking hit me. Fucking hit me, dude. Jeez. Ugh. Yeah, they were literally just sitting there, not doing anything. Yeah, this is hard mode. I want to see some violence. Come on, just hit me, please. Come on. Come on, you little asshole. Thank you. Oh, whoops. This hand tries to grab me. 
two, three, four, five. Oh my god, come on, man. I need to go back into the skill tree in order to do this, right? Wait, what? Is it because I'm in here? That was stressful and I'm not even playing. <laughs> yeah, no, that was that was a tough one. Like it it wasn't tough in the fact that like you know, it was hard to actually, like, you know, beat them because I was dying a lot or whatever. They just wouldn't attack me. Excuse me. If I'm you, going to waste time... You still need the four pieces for the heart? I was about to say, I, I did it, though. Alright, there's one. There we go. It just wouldn't let me do it because I was in there. There we go. Now that that's out of the way, let's continue. I also feel like this is faster. Uh, I don't need to go here. That voice. Oh, you get full heal when you upgrade. Gotcha. I love how Bayonetta is just walking around with her giant Gatling gun. Someone's having fun. At least Kitty's landed on her feet. It's a rhinoceros! Oh shit! Asperitus! That was close. All right, Madama Butterfly. Actually, you know what? I don't need no Madama Butterfly. Shit. 
Torture attack! Woo! Come on. You know what I love too? They totally stole the uh, the freeze finish from DMC, DMC, and DMC5. It's such a subtle thing, but it's noticeable. Spider section? Not quite a convertible, but I could get used to this. Oh god. It's about time I got moving. No. Alright. Oh nope, that's the wrong button. It's about time I got moving. No. Oh, there's a thing here. I wanna kill it. Oh, shit. <laughs> Tail pincer. Excuse me. I almost fell off the side because of that. Oh! Oh, shit! <laughs> Whoops. Oh, come on, bro! There we go. It's about time I got moving again. Oh yay, forced walking section with the spider. Yeah, I will say the spider section does feel weird in comparison. Like just a tiny bit clunky, just a little bit. Kill this thing. Rar, rar. I'm a spider. Ugh. Oh, you better not. I was about to say, that's not fair, bro. Blah 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 blah. I'm just waiting for the QTs at this point. Woo! He's swinging! <laughs> oh my god! This is so cool! That was so cool! I'm the Spooter Man! Exactly, DeFor. What's going on, bro? Uh, I, all right, I got stuck. Hold up. All right, there we go. Ugh. Yo, this building's literally trying to crush me like the spider I am. Oh my god. Alright, I can't jump. That's fine.
Alright, so... Where's the way out? It's over here. I really do love that Bayo just needs to, like, keep dancing in order to get this spider moving. Oh no! Bayo got crushed like the spider! Is Spider gonna take a break now? Ooh, there's a thing up here. Let me get this thing. No! The spider! Uh. Okay. I don't know what this is. Thank you. All right, we Helmbreaker. I just realized that actually is Helmbreaker, but just with my foot. You missed me. Oh my god, I keep doing that for weapon swap, and it's obviously not the right thing. Oh, you fucking- Hey, hey, yo. Ah, oh, you fucking listen. Oh my god, dude. There, there's totally another enemy. The fuck is that? At last, someone with no strings attached. And what's your name, my furry friend? Oh yeah, saxophone goes so hard, it's so great. Is this just an enemy introduction? I rather enjoy teaching obedience. <laughs> I'll have you rolling over in no time, Spot. What if this is just a basic enemy? Twilight Wanderer, Strider Hear You. Bet. I have no health. An angel or a demon. And I am almost dead. Roar! I'm an elephant! Oh shit. You missed me! Fuck! <laughs> he literally hit me with the Nero dropkick and said, Hey, asshole. Alright, let's fucking try this.
Punish him! Heal, boy! I don't like that prompt. I don't like the stick waggling prompt. Make it a circle. Holy shit, this is so fucking cool. Oh, you... Seven frames! Seven frames, there it is! Shit, that was cool. There was the Platinum Game Studio logo right there. That was hot. That was great. God. Seems like you're ready for the leash. Ooh. The fucking heel stomp. Now why don't you sit for mummy? <laughs> I can't. Hmm. Perhaps I shouldn't have rubbed his nose. Oh, I fucking. Ugh. I'm sorry, I need to fucking- I'm so goddamn thirsty. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. What? What a gal. Son of a bitch! <laughs> I... I don't even know what else to say about that. That was great. Holy shit. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is where we're gonna end off for today. So... <laughs> I don't even- I don't even know what to say. This- this game is... is next level. I am really, really enjoying this and everything that's been offered so far. Um, especially in the first two missions. Um, all of the mechanics I really, really enjoy. And, um, yeah, I just can't wait to play more of this. So definitely be on the lookout for more videos coming later this week and in the upcoming weeks as well. I'm going to be splitting the videos down just a little bit, like I mentioned in the beginning of the video here. So they're going to be shorter in length, but there's going to be more of them coming throughout, uh, the playthrough session. But so far, what do you guys think of Bayonetta 3? Have you beaten it yet? Uh, what is your favorite weapon to use so far? And what do you think of all of the super over dramatic set pieces? Make sure to comment below, let me know, and as always, if you like what you see and you want to see more, leave a like, hit the subscribe button, turn on the notifications to get notified on when the videos come out, 
And if you want to catch me live, follow my uh, Twitch link down in the description below. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon.